Okay, so welcome back to episode two. Uh, last time uh, I got to this safe spot um, by getting an egg of some sort. I don't know what it is yet. We'll find out. But uh, I had to um, a special attack. It's right up here. See, there's one right up there in the tree. The things that keep blowing up. How do you use that to open the door? Open the safe slot. There's one right here again. Perfect things. for a village. I think there's a chest back here. Chest right there. there. Down. Okay, so there's a similar wall here that I need in one of the explosive eggs to. about that. Not a problem at all. Stand back. All right, I've got it. Wait, no. Oh. 
having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Aw, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh. Like we're heading in the right direction. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. Don't worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. <sighs> ah, it's another one of those spiky slime things. Their persistence will give them that. Much as I pity this corrupted beast, now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Allow it to strike. Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, Put this beast out of its misery. Nice. It looks like when you parry, it makes the enemy much weaker. I see somebody over there. Ask them if they've got anything to eat. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet! But, uh, I would appreciate that. Thanks. Oh, you surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes, it's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Yes, please hurry. Be careful. Yeah, I got experience with talking to her. Please. Stop's restocked. Save point. I think I can handle it. Exercise all you've learned, Dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. Got the little guys first. Do the quick, quick eat. Right. Okay. I pick up anything I can. 
That would help me. a worthy swords master and none too soon bah they weren't so tough i could probably take on another four or five of them you know if i had to and that's was there oh thank you so much what happened here i i don't know we were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end, Dust. The village lies just ahead. Yes, we arrived, and that's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. Will you two be all right? Yes, I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. Hey, who are you calling weak? <laughs> I talk to him. We're still a little... I just need to sit here for a while. You should get to safety when you can. I cleared out quite a few monsters on the way in. But you never know when they'll be back. Did one of those monsters hurt you? Well, I mean, not exactly. This old lug twisted his ankle running away from those monsters. Nice of you to stick around to protect your poor old wife. I was running to get help. Yeah, lots of help in the tool shed, I'm sure. What, you got a little army hiding in there? Maybe I should go. Oh, no, please don't get the wrong idea. I still love my husband, even if he is a coward. Bah! Oh, by yourself. Okay, so I'm going to stop this episode here. Um, made it to chapter one? Or do we make it out of chapter one? I'm not sure. I think we made it to chapter one. But, um, yeah, I'll try to keep these episodes to about 15 minutes or so, like this one. So, keep watching. I'll have episode three up. And, uh, thanks. <laughs>